Hi, I'm Hunter Schaefer, and I'm doing a first times video with Netta Porte. First time I wore a jewels worthy look on the red carpet. The first one that comes to mind is a look that Sandy and I did together and she had this idea to like encrust one of my fingers with iridescent jewels, like completely cover it. Um, and it took like an hour and people kept asking me to flick them off that night. And I feel like jewels would vibe with that look. The first time I did something daring with my hair and makeup, uh, I think I had a sleepover when I was like in middle school or something with two of my friends from church and uh, we got into one of their things of makeup and like essentially did drag without really knowing what drag was. I remember drawing flames uh, on my face with eyeliner and eyeshadow and then like gelling my hair up and it was short at the time so it was like sticking out everywhere. It was fun. First time I felt inspired by someone else's style and beauty. Raven, massive style inspo. I just went through one of like my boxes with all my like drawings and paper dolls in it at home. And just, I, I swear to God, there were like 25 Raven paper dolls and I did different variations of her outfits. And uh, definitely first style icon was Raven from Teen Titans. The first time I spoke up about something I was passionate about was when I asked my parents for a box of entirely shocking pink crayons when I was like three. I have been drawing ever since I can remember. I cannot remember a time when I wasn't drawing. I don't think I remember the first time I realized I loved drawing but I'm constantly re-falling in love with it in new ways, so I guess like all the time. First album I fell in love with. I kind of have like three. Watermark by Enya, I remember we had a CD uh, when like my siblings and I were like in elementary school and we put it on all the time and that album felt like magical to me. I don't know why we had that in our house. And then I kind of had like a toxic love for the Fame Monster by Lady Gaga when I was in middle school because I knew I wasn't like allowed to listen to it, but I did. And I felt like sinful for listening to it, but it was it, it was magic. And then like my first real falling in love with an album was Pure Heroin by Lord in high school. Uh, meeting the cast of Euphoria was kind of sequential. I think I first met Barbie, because we were both models in New York at the time. And then I met Jacob in my final audition. And then I met the rest of the cast on like one of our first rehearsal days, I think. First time a fan recognized me on the street. I feel like that was probably, I think Barbie and I were out together somewhere in LA and someone came up to us for the first time and we like freaked out together. And, be, and someone came up to us knowing us from Euphoria and, and we were like, Ugh, like, what, what, it's happening. And then it kept happening after that. <laughs>